How to get your iPhone ready for iOS 18. To get your iPhone ready for iOS 18, here are some key steps you can follow to ensure a smooth update process. Step 1. Check device compatibility. First, ensure your iPhone model supports iOS 18. Apple typically supports devices for 5 to 6 years, so newer iPhones are likely to be compatible. iOS 18 expected list of compatible devices. Step 2. Back up your iPhone. Before any major update, it's crucial to back up your data to avoid losing important files. You can back up your iPhone using Back up your iPhone or iPad with iCloud. Back up manually. Connect your device to a Wi-Fi network, go to settings greater than your name, and tap iCloud. Tap iCloud backup. Tap backup now. Stay connected to your Wi-Fi network until the process ends. Under Backup Now, the date and time of your last backup is shown. Automatically backup with iCloud Backup, go to Settings, Your Name, iCloud, iCloud Backup, and make sure that backup this device is turned on. Connect your device to a power source. Connect your device to a Wi-Fi network. Make sure that your device's screen is locked. Backup your iPhone with iTunes. Make sure iTunes is installed. Connect your iPhone to your computer using a Lightning USB cable. Open the device in iTunes if you want to have a more accurate detection. Ensure that the encrypted backup option is activated and choose a secure password for the backup. Start the backup and wait for it to finish. Backup with Finder. Launch Finder on your Mac. Connect your iPhone to your Mac using a Lightning USB cable. Select your device from the list of devices located at the bottom of the left sidebar labeled locations. In the General tab, select Backup all the data on your iPhone to this Mac from the options under the Backups section. Check the box that says Encrypt Local Backup. If it is your first time selecting this option, you may need to enter a password to encrypt the backup. Click Backup now to start the backup process. The encrypted backup for your iPhone should now start. Once the process finished, you can check the backup by opening Finder, clicking on the General tab, then click on Manage Backup. Now you should see a list of your backups like the image below. Free up storage space. iOS updates can require several gigabytes of free space. You can go to Settings, General, iPhone Storage to see how much space you have. Offload and used apps, delete old media, and clear cache or temporary files. 4. Update apps. Ensure all your apps are up to date, as older versions might not be optimized for iOS 18. Head to the App Store, tap your profile, and update all apps. 5. Check battery health. A degraded battery might cause issues with the update process or result in faster battery drain post-update. You can check your battery health under Settings, Battery, Battery Health. 6. Ensure latest version of iOS. If you're not already on the latest version of iOS 17, update your iPhone to ensure compatibility and a smoother transition to iOS 18. Go to Settings, General, Software Update. 7. Check Wi-Fi and Power. When updating, ensure your iPhone is connected to a strong Wi-Fi network and is fully charged or connected to a charger to prevent any interruptions. 8. Remove beta profiles. If you're running an iOS beta version, it's advisable to remove the profile by going to Settings, General, VPN and Device Management, and delete the beta profile to avoid conflicts. 9. Prepare for new features. Look out for any major new features in iOS 18 that could impact how you use your phone and check for potential compatibility issues with accessories or software you rely on. Once your iPhone is ready, you'll be all set to update to iOS 18 once it's available. Thank you for your watching video and hope this can helping you.